the books that we read, add to our mental toolkit for solving problems. This one's got a tremendous amount of illustrations all throughout the book that are really visually easy to read, which helps us build our visual library, comparing what we see in here with what we see on site with everything labeled all throughout. But it also covers nuance like slab preparation. So you can see all the formwork being built up around where the slab's going to be, as well as how the formwork is actually set so that the reinforcement is at the right height. Love these kind of illustrations. And it also does go into double brick construction as well, with some really great details that have been shaded with pen weights that make it really easy to read. Block work is also covered. And again, so many great illustrations covering so many of the different foundational areas. We've got a low set brick veneer covered here where it's bearers and joists on an enclosed subfloor. And we're showing everything here. We've got the brick ties all the way down to the ventilators, the vermin proof mesh, not to mention the typical slab on ground as well, running through all the different stages of the process from the set out all the way up to the roof with other nuanced areas like kitchen layouts, as well as different ideal house styles for different sloping blocks. And we've also got level ones here too, which is pretty cool. If you have anything to do with residential construction, it's information like this I wish I had in the beginning when I first started. Illustrated in a really easy to consume format.